Even when the sun isn't quite shining, the coastal views of Bournemouth still manage to attract people from all over the country. A desperate need for renewable energy in the UK in order for the government to meet their 15% target, however, could soon mean that the horizon will be dotted with a stretch of wind turbines. The project has been proposed by Novartis Spade Development, which if given the go-ahead will be fully operational by 2020. An open meeting held on Saturday by the Conservatives here at the Royal Bath Hotel updated local residents with the progress of the proposal. The panel of speakers urged the 400 strong crown to write to Novartis to have their voices heard. I guess as an organisation of residents in the area, we're concerned uh, about the visual impact for one thing, that's a very important aspect. Impacts on the tourism economy, the leisure industry, which obviously is a very important economy in this area. Representatives from local green groups supporting the wind farm also attended the meeting, but left disappointed, adding that a balanced view had not been provided. Well, I, I do think we've got to really uh, seriously invest in renewables because our fossil fuel industry, well, number one, it's dirty, it's dangerous, it's wiping out life on the planet, and we've got to find cleaner ways of generating electricity, and this is a very good way to do that. Opinions over the impact of the wind farm are for now still divided, and only time will tell the outcome. This is Alice Penfold for Buzz News.